What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FC24 video. EA have released a 1 of 3 91 plus all tots, the La Liga team of the season pack. We've also got the daily play objective and the daily upgrade, I think, objective today. So lots of packs to grind for, but what I'm most interested in for today is, is the, the 1 of 3 91 all tots going to be worth it in the long run? Uh, I feel like it's like one of the best chances you're going to get to improve your squad, even if it might just be a bit of fodder by the end of it. And is that La Liga Tots pack going to be worth it? Let's find out. Of course, if you guys are enjoying the content, you want to drop a thumbs up, it would be very much appreciated. Do you know what? I would love that Dion card myself as a first owner. I know he's cheap and I could just buy him off the market, but... Oh, he's a good card. And I think he fits... Right, he's right up my street with the way I play this game. Um, which is nice. And then this guy gets an 88 and an 89 from his uh, other player picks, which is quite nice. Rodri is unfortunately not a tradable duplicate. And then how good is this? Pots La Liga pack. Let me know down below what you got. Team of the season guaranteed is going to be quite good as well, I suppose. Because there's so many good Rodri. Unai Simon. Damn. Um, oh, wait, it's not even. <laughs> That's even worse. Oh, that, that was like literally just worse and worse and worse. And then last but not least, we got the Liga Pots Guarantee. And this one is going to give us Spain left back. I have a feeling these La Liga Tots packs are going to be like the ones that we was able to see a while back where it is just going to be filled, absolutely filled with Miguel Gutierrez and Alex Garcia, which is a bit sad. Arsenal themed, just because, you know. Damn, damn. It doesn't really matter who you pick there, does it? Yeah, Dovic. Mate, how has he not got Ariel? He's got Ariel Plus, I think, on one of his other cards, hasn't he? He doesn't even have Ariel. This guy's got 8 million coins. Spain, striker. Who's that? Rafa Mujica. Nice. Not nice. Terrible. Doesn't even get into the 89 exchange. He's that bad. That is not what we're looking for. Then La Liga Tots guarantee. Oh, it's the right back in it. Yeah, that's pain. That's pain. You have 8 million coins now. Why? Yeah. Yeah, literally. Why? Surely you just go and buy the best players in the game, right? 21,000 coins left for this guy. Maybe saving for Neymar. Uh, yeah, it might be. Might be. Oh, this guy's got the 83. Sorry, the 85 pluses. Give me blue. I'm on the 8. Team of the season. Don't mind 88s. Deary me. Deary, deary me. All right, come on. A good tots from here, please, EA. Okay, Pellegrini's... Like, do you know what? Even Wendell is not bad, to be fair. Do you know what I would have done there? I would have taken that Wendell. Do you know why? Brazilian. So, if... EA give us some fun content um, for Copa America where it requires like a Brazilian squad. Wendell with plus chemistry is good. Declan Rice. Oh, it's, uh, what's his name? Sheaf. Yeah, Wendell is actually going to be really, really nice. So for that reason alone, I would have taken him. But who knows? This guy might already have like 17 different versions of Roberto Carlos. Spain left mid. Athletic Club Bilbao. And it is going to be Williams. Reasonable card in game. Um, but, yeah. And then he's got the FX players pack. I quite like this one, to be fair. Show us blue, otherwise I'm leaving straight away. Yeah, I'm gone. You know, she's left. She's now joined Chelsea. That's the end. Her end of era is like as a Leon manager. But the very least they could have done. The very least they could have done is give her like an upgraded card. You know? Like, just make it a 94 or a 95 or or make, like, no, that that's literally it. Just make it a 94 or a 95. <laughs> like, um, like be, because you've given her an end of an era card that's been in the game for, like, four months. Maybe not that long. Maybe, like, three months. Um, But, yeah. And Bon Pastor as well. Because then it's like, oh, look at that. We get, like, flashback insert player. Oh, also, yeah, have given us, like, Bon Pastor SBC. That's pretty cool because she's left, you know, she's left, um, she's left Leona's manager. Oh, that's, like, all of a sudden the narrative for EA changes massively 
And people are like, oh, how cool was that? Like, not only did they give us a flashback or an end of an era, ooh, katoto, um, but also we got Bon Pastor. That's cool. When it's only Bon Pastor and it's, oh, okay, <laughs> and it's not even a special card design, it's, it's genuinely kind of like, well, anybody that really wanted that card has probably already got that card. <laughs> yeah, Joe Hart, end of an era would have been good. Uh, there's a few other goalkeepers, I think, that would have been good. There, there's, I mean, there's just a lot of players that, that EA could have given an end of an era to. Um, damn, Majri is very, very, very good in this game. Very good. That is, a good, I don't know what her value is. I don't even care. I think that's a solid pickup. Hear me out. Release a Bomb Pastor end of an era Evo. Special card design only allow Bomb Pastor cards in Evo. Yeah, how cool would that be? That would be cool. That would be cool. EA have said Cruz won't get an end of an era this week because he has international football left. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so if they, they even spoke about it, then perfect, right? All right. Hegeberge. He he Damn, this guy's flexing how stacked his club is. Look at me. Everything's already owned. Nice, man. Nice. One of three... Ezraburge, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, you want to take that? To the exchange. Um, and then not bad. Balotelli's a beast in game. Gabriel, I'm not I like I know everyone's entitled to their opinion on who their favorite cards in the game are. Gabriel is without doubt, without doubt, the best centre back I've used in this game this year. Without any shadow of a doubt. Have I used Bissek? I have used some Bissek, yeah. Only, only his blue one. I haven't used an evo version of him, but only his regular one. He's like regular tots. Oh, Karim Benzema. Then. Jurassic, Tap Soba, and Nasi. Pepe for you. Yeah, Pepe looks insane, yeah. 99 aggression. He's probably actually got about 100 aggression, isn't he? 110 aggression. Team of the season guaranteed. I want to be in America. Everything's free in America. 94 rated. Germer is not bad. Bad. Then the La Liga Tots. Let me guess. Brazil. Spain. Unai Simon. Unlucky. Game of AC about. Pepe has a holy trinity of press proven, bruiser, and anticipate. There's only Saliba, Williamson for birthday, and Oberdorf that have those three at centre back. Do you know what's mad though? Like, I don't dislike Saliba, team of the season. I think he's good. I just don't think he's great. Like, he doesn't stand out for me. Like, if of the the team of the seasons that I have at centre-back, he would be the one I would replace first instantly. He just doesn't do... He, he just doesn't exceed and excel. I don't know, it's weird. Um... Batlum, thanks for the 100 pal. I can't wait for Euro on FC24. I'm Albanian. I don't think we'll do well, but you think EA will give all nation a card? Yeah, I think so. I think you'll get one or two Albanian cards. Who, who's your, like, top player? Who like, the top one or two players? Yeah, it might, it might be his stamina. Okay, who's that? Oh, it's uh, Vigoz Dottir. Oh, it's duplicate. I like it. Renard for 91 plus. Good, yeah. Renard's beast. Sounds very good. Strako, sure. Is that a goalkeeper? Crane, Strice, Dovbik again in it. God damn it. Roja. Is that a Chelsea or the ex-Chelsea striker? But, ooh, look at this guy with his premium reds. This is the old Belgian team. Go on then. Go on then. Go on then. It's only De Bruyne that you want, huh? Most people's teams are cracked. They are. I've only played around 130 hours and my worst player in the 11 is Zanetti. So somebody in the chat earlier had posted that they started a brand new account. So I'm going to be doing this as well. I don't know if I'll be as quick or as successful as them. But they went from like Division 10 to Elite Division on a brand new account. The guy was like, it took me three days and my team stacked. And so, yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit of a weird one because I think I'm going to start on Division 10 to Elite Division RTG probably on Thursday for the new season. Um... And I just, I just know that the team's going to be absolutely cracked before I even get anywhere close. Yeah, the Euros are going to be mad. It's coming around quick, though, isn't it? It is coming around quick. It's already the fourth. Kimmich. Damn, no team of the seasons are coming out of these. 
So if I've already got 4k XP, is it enough now for me to go full Umbigel? Is it enough to go me, for me to go to level 40 with everything that's there? Bear in mind, I will not be able to get any rewards for XP. It will have to be just... Oh, blue. It will have to be just what's literally there available. I will play the UFL Open Beta, yeah. Bane again. Left mid. Oh, shit. Unlucky. Unlucky. It's quite an interesting team, isn't it? Some fun cards there. The 91 all tots. So far, these have been very underwhelming. Very underwhelming. What am I drinking? It's just Red Bull, pal. Kudus, Bretongan, Benassir. Yeah. I honestly would probably take Bretongan there. I'd like Kudus a 10 a penny in the game these days. That is all he's got. He's only got 35,000 coins as well. Tough out here. Will you be able to stream the UFL open beta? I presume so. If it's an open beta, I presume so. Got Ben. Ooh, Bellingham or White. Oh, yeah, I have better. I have white now, which is great. First owned. It's just rice that I'm missing out from the Arsenal players. I, th I think Bellingham is a quality card as well, to be fair. Damn, look at all those pixels. Another Belgian team. That's the second Belgian Belgian team that we've seen. Quite interesting, isn't it? Maybe, maybe, maybe uh, them on because it's not uh, Jude Bellingham. It's Joba Bellingham. Jamie Vardy. I bet he's actually a beast in game, isn't he? I haven't, I haven't had the pleasure of playing with him, but I bet he's a beast in game. Damn, people aren't even doing that pack. I, I don't even blame you guys for not doing the uh, the La Liga Tots pack because it's bad, isn't it? Yeah, did the Sunderland badge not give it away? Maybe. The more eighty-five pluses will tell us. Not bad. I don't even think I've packed her gold card this year. I still don't think I've packed her Bon Matty. Or Mbappe golds. Do you know what? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's too bad. It's already owned. I don't even think I've hit Vinicius Jr. gold card this year. I have hit his... Oh, Haka Halonolu. Very nice. I have hit his... um 92 rated Team of the Year nominee card. But I haven't hit his gold card the whole year. I've hit Hansen a couple of times. Uh, Messi loads. Ronaldo, obviously. Benzema loads. But... Yeah, I, I am missing out on so many. Like, I probably haven't packed four or five gold cards so far this year, which is wild given how many packs have been in the game this year, how long the game's been out, and how many, like, player picks and stuff like that that I've done. Wild. Yeah, I've got Van Dyke, I've got Kerr. I'm lucky on the Savio uh, temp, pal. And EA say every player at the same rating has the same weight. I don't know where you got that from. EA don't say that at all. All right, another 91 tots. Here we go. Damn, this guy's got mad amounts of blues, isn't he? Veerman. Quality card in game, Veerman. Use him in the draft a couple of times. Enjoyed him. Enjoyed him. Yeah, I've hit Kerb. Maybe only once or twice for Kerb, but I have, I have packed her. Mate, otherwise, though, like, outside of those golds, I've hit, like, 97 Hernandez, Team of the Season Saka, uh, Red Dembele, <laughs> Red Zer Emery, you know. <laughs> oh, I've actually had really terrible luck this year. Really terrible luck. Really terrible luck, right. I got his uh, La Liga tots. Oh, Premier League tots guarantee as well. I'm on EA, England. Send a, send a, send a, oh, Ben White again, never mind. You don't think you've even got Salah gold? I've, I've hit Salah a few times. Yeah, Kerr, Kerr is really, really rare. Will there be F1 with next night? Yeah, there should, should be. I, I plan to. I have still got to play... Well, I'm 7 and 6 on the England Evo RTG. I ideally would like 11 wins on there. But honestly, 9 might have to be the way. But I can play that like in my own time after I finish streaming. To exhaust you, probably just go for 9. I'll, I'll, I'll try and play to 11 on the England account. It's just hard. It's just hard. Like, everybody's team is cracked. People are very good at the game now. Like... It's not even the people are good at the game either. The game, when your team, like, look at this guy's team, right? It's so good. The game, like, when, you, when you've got the team that I've got for the England account, even if you're, like, an 11-win player, I would struggle against this team because the teams, like, play themselves. You know what I mean? The teams do themselves. Just go to 11. Um, but that's the thing. 
I might not even get to 11. Was it easy or difficult? Oh, it was, it was hard, mate. It was hard. And it was, it was tough, man. It was tough. Every game was like a battle, even on the way up. Oh, Harry Kane, let's go, dude. Even on the way up in those early games where you expect to get the odd easy player here or there, none of them were easy. All of it was difficult. All of it was difficult. Got the guarantee. Here we go. Striker. Bubba. White. Nope. Davis. Nice. Not bad. We've finally seen a, a good card out of there. Harry Kane. Very nice. Malik, thanks for the seven months, man. All right. Team of the season. League one guaranteed. Brazil. Behold, oh dear. Spain left mid again. That is tough. That is tough. And I know it's so like, in like it's very easy after the fact to be like, oh, look at me, 16 wins. Like, you know, like get on a high horse and be like, I just played like this and how how uh you know how freeing was it for me? But I genuinely like spent it be, because I like I got to four and oh. Then I got then I lost. Went four and one. Okay, this guy got draft. Um yeah, I went four and one. Um and I was kind of like, whatever, man. I'm just, you know, I'm, I am just want to get to 11 as quick as I can. Get my two player picks. And I'll see where I'm at after 11 wins. And yeah, just let me get my two player picks and, and be done with it. And so I wasn't really playing to play up to a high rank. I was just playing to get to 11 wins. So every game I was just focused on doing what made sense to try and get the win, right? So I know it sounds easy, but I was literally like, get the ball. Do the meta stuff. I've started adding step overs into my game a lot more, which has been really helpful. Having Terry Hernandez at left back, so good. <laughs> He's like, like McCabe is very good, very good. Terry Hernandez is like worlds better. Having Olivier Giroud up front and having that big man up front, amazing. Having, of course, I put Zé Emery, Rodri, and Dembele in. Like just having like the best team that I could play with. Ferguson there, unlucky pal. I didn't change any tactics or anything, mate. I just, I just played more composed, man. I played off stream, which helped. You know, when I was taking the L's, because like, like the the two losses I took up to fifteen wins. Damn, ninety four nanny, pop him in the Navas SBC. You know what I'm saying? Um, that's a that's a solid pick. That is. Um, yeah, the two losses that I took up to fifteen wins were really tough games, competitive games. I could have won them. I wasn't completely outclassed. I lost them both by one goal. And I just lost them. I was like, no worries. Let me just move on to the next. I just want to get to 11. When I got to 15 and 2, that's when I got nervous. Oh, it's Denny Buanga. That's really unlucky. Yeah, when I got to 15 and 2, that's when I got really nervous. I was like, oh, shit. I've got three games to get one win. And let me tell you this, man. The guy I played at 15 and 2, he had a bang average team. Like, like even for this stage of the game, like he, he had still like... 88 rated promo cards from like three, four promos ago and stuff like that. He was bad, bad. And he was so bad at the game. And I was nervous, man. My energy was weird. I was like, you know, the anxiety or the the kind of like nerves were were, were getting the better of me. And I just couldn't, I couldn't believe how I lost to him, man. And he was the worst player I played the whole weekend. And he's the one that I lost to. And I was like, oh, crap, man. Because at that point, you go from 15 and two, you one win from three games, it's easy. You go from 15 and two. Oh, this guy's got champs rewards. You go from 15 and 2 to 15 and 3. Now, all of a sudden, in my head, I'm like, oh crap, if I lose the next game, it's not like at this level, the next one's going to be easier. Everyone's a demon up here, man. Everyone's a beast at this level. So if I go 15 and 2 to 15 and 3 to 15 and 4, I'm just going to choke it again. I'm going to finish on 15 and 5. I know, I know I am. Fortunately, the guy that I played against in the, the next game, he was good. But I was just better. He had a sick team as well, man. It was a tough game. He was good. And I just stay, I just, I, in my head, I was like, whatever. Let me just compose, man. Let me just stay composed. Barilla, nice. Let me just stay composed. Let me just focus. Let me just try and score my goals. I went 2-1 down in the 70th minute. Ooh, Zer Emery, not a duplicate either. Mate, he's going to put this card in his team and people are going to go, oh, look at you glitching your rewards. <laughs> That's unlucky. Um... Yeah, and I and I was like, let me just try and score goals, man. And then he lost his head in extra time. We went, we oh my days, Jesus Christ! Guys, rewards are nice. Um, yeah, he lost his head in extra time. He got two red cards, and I ended up like walking away with an easy win. 
in your, in your own time. There we go. Thank you, very, thank you very much. And then last but not least, Basha, Koulibaly, and Ferguson. Damn. That was nice, wasn't it? Yeah, those were insane rewards. Zer, Emery, and James. Very nice indeed, mate. GG's. GG's. I don't think he was uh, ultimate tots. Jordi Alba is a good card to get, man. Especially if you've got a version of Messi. If you've got like that team of the year 0.7% Messi. James is under 400k. Oh my days, man. That's mad, isn't it? And then we've got the Spanish cam. That is go. That's all. Do you know what? I say that's all right. He's probably about 60k now. <laughs> he's, he's probably so cheap. I mean, he's a solid card, to be fair. No, that's that's actually a good price still on him. Hey, GG's Gary, man. Well done. 27th of May, he was down at 836k. Yesterday, he was 225k. And he's now 83k. What the hell? That's insane. Josh, you remember when we were talking about when, when these prices were crashing? And I think you thought they were going to rebound like quite a lot. And I, wow. That's unreal. And I thought they were going to rebound like a little bit. And they just haven't. <laughs> They've just stayed going down. <laughs> Which is mad. The four play style pluses need to come, don't they? Damn, little Casemiro there as well. Here we are again at the Casemiro Gardens. GG's, mate. GG's. Mate, that Smith is so good, man. Wow. Wow. What are you saying? You, wow. What are you saving packs for, Abdul? Bellingham is 4 million. Kane is 570k. Grimpong's 1.1 million. Bonmati 600k. Smith 560k. Messi's only 3.4 million. That Latara Martinez is only 420k. Mbappe is now down at 9 million. He was extinct. LA Galaxy is Cruz's destination. Wait, is he not actually... F I thought he was like just retiring. That's it. Simmons, Vertonghen and Gabriel. Damn. Eric Hernandez, 1.2 million. Ronaldo, 4.5 million. Valverde is only 550k. Vinny J is only 3 million. No, he is retiring. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. Chawinga 390. Rice is down at 259k. Rafael Liao is now under a million coins. Debinha is 36k. That is a 95 rated team of the season who is insane with plus chemistry. And she is 36k. What? Wait. Real Madrid. Vinicius Jr. Rodrigo. Rodrigo. Still though, all right though. Right, right, right. That's all right. Guys, I can't even believe these prices. Jamal Musial is 330k. Grimaldo is only 200. Oops, sorry. 200. <laughs> Grimaldo is only 270k. Kemp is 85k. Salah, 900k. Lewandowski is 97,000 coins. What the actual crap? Uli Bali, 32. Lewandowski is 97k. What? Ferguson's 32k. Golovin, 33k. Basha is only 33k. Stanway, 34k. Foden, 470. Savio, 32. Alderweireld, 29. Mares, 29. And Schlotterbeck, 30, uh, 20, 35. What? Guys, even with the new promo coming, the new Euros promo, how are cards ever going to have value now when you can go and get three Playstyle Plus endgame cards for like 50 and 60k? Like, yeah, okay, like you're going to have like a Euro card that's got four Playstyle Pluses instead. But there's no way that they're going to hold value. They can't. Here we are again, the Gazimir Gardens. GG's, brother. Got his pack as well, was he? What we all wanted. The high-end cards will be available to everyone. Happy days. Yeah, I mean, I don't I don't completely disagree. Oh, wow. Carl Hein has been dropped by Estonia. Hey, this, this, this week, though, even if you got, like, just rotating. Okay. Even if you, like, getting unlucky with, like, the MPs and stuff, I wouldn't even sweat because everyone's going to be in the, uh, 
the same boat. Like with these friendlies, it's just going to be an absolute nightmare. I'm half hoping that uh, Providel gets gets the start for Italy. Alex Garcia for this guy. Like, man, even if you got like now like a Lewandowski. Wait, how much was Kane? Kane was like 500k or something, wasn't he? 570k for Harry Kane. Okay. <laughs> you know how good the Harry Kane is. Pretty sure they said that at the start. There, 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 there will be four playstyle pluses. I, I, I also agree that they said at the start that three playstyle pluses would be the max. Wait. Wait. Erland. Um, but I guess that they've just changed on that. And we are we are getting four playstyle pluses. GG's Johan Pal. Power curve's too quick. Well, it seems like we're getting an even bigger power curve, doesn't it? Because it seems like we're now going to get four playstyle pluses through the Euros with live cards as well. Which, I mean, it's great. And the mid. Ah, oh, Dewsbury Hall. I like it. Yeah, Basher at 30k is wild. Like, there, there are, like, not even just Basher at 30k. Mares at 29,000 coins. He has plus chemistry, five star, four star, and insane stats and playstyles and playstyle pluses. You've got Aldo Wereld with plus chemistry, who's phenomenal as a centre back at 29k. Stanway, who's phenomenal at 34k. Basher at 33k. Golovin at 33k. Ferguson and Koulibaly, who also has plus chemistry at 32k each. <laughs> it's mind blowing how cheap these good cards are. Mind blowing. All right. Player picks and player picks. Wow. The 85 of the 86. Come on, Kerr. Here's our 91 all tots. Even look, look at that Berardi as well. Berardi's such a sick card. And I know he's cheap. The La Liga tots guarantee. Here we go. Bane. Never mind. Never mind, Celtic. Here we go. The last ones for today, guys. I think it's fair to say that these 91 All Tots packs haven't been worth it. Not just because the cards coming out of them have been bad, but even like when it's a sick card, they're worth nothing. They're just worthless. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm a bit confused as to what EA can do from here because they can't be put charging like 85 and 87 rated squads for you to even get like a massive 95 Dabinia who's worth 30, 36k, right? Um... So I, I don't know what EA's gonna do. I genuinely, I'm confused. I, I genuinely don't know. Um, but yeah, let's get these uh these last couple of packs for today. If you did get something sick, it would still be fun for you to let me know down below what you got. As always, thank you very much for watching. We are gonna end on this fight. Wow, thank you. Oh, he's we're we're gonna end here, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and I will see you. Peace.